Hi, I'm Jay with Wheatstone, and today we're going to talk about a new application our design engineers made called Remix. And Remix is an application, a standalone application, that you can install on any PC or a remote PC that will give you access to the utility mixers that natively come in every single blade. Um, we've got a lot of IP12 users and a lot of blade users out there that are thinking about remote control and you've always been able to get to these mixers via screen builder but we've made a small inexpensive program that you can run and get access to those so you can build mixes on the fly and allow remote control by your talent without being invasive into the navigator program so i'm going to open up one show you what it is and then we'll build one real quick for you so i've already installed the program on my computer i'm double click the icon i select the network i want to be on and the blade that I want to talk to with its mixer. So we've already got blade three or IP address 103 configured. So you simply hit connect. The program will go out. It's gonna pull the existing status of that UMix. So we've got a mic, we've got all of our Zeta channels here. We've got a codec phone and our satellite program. This will allow the operator to come in, turn channels on off, you know, control levels, if you are a next-gen user or a Zeta user, you have a popular automation system and you want to advance to the next track, we've given you three soft keys for that. Um, we've got this labeled Talkback, but basically it's just another SLIO that can advance you to the next track. Um, Remix gives you access to Mixer A and Mixer B on that. Um, so the correlating utility mixer is here in blade number three. So you'll see the sources here and Remix are in the exact same spot. And so what this is, is Remix is a simple app that's gonna go out, it's gonna grab the existing utility mixer that you've enabled and allow remote control. So now that you've seen how it works, I'll just take, through, take you through a minute, we'll just set one up real quick. So we're gonna close the Remix application the first thing that you want to make sure is that you have a blade available to talk to or the utility mixer. So we'll simply come up here to uh, we'll hide this guy, come up here to blade one. Notice here I've got blade one utility mixer, we've got no sources. So first thing, first thing I'm going to do is enable that mixer, and then we're just going to double click on here. It's going to give me access to the entire Wheatstone matrix. And so I know that we're going to be doing a remote program, so I'm going to need a codec on one of the faders, uh, maybe a couple codecs. Let's get a microphone on there. We're gonna take a, uh, uh, a telephone here on two. Um, let's go down and get some automation channels so we can play some music when we're done. And I can go down here to RCS and I can grab RCS A, I can grab RCS B, I can grab that stack. Looking at this utility mixer real quick, I'll turn the channel on, we'll turn the channel on here. We can see that we've got output on A, we'll go ahead and turn output on B. So we've got codec, we've got fill, RCS, B, A, B, and a stack. Once we've configured this in Navigator, all we need to do now is go to our Remix application that we've got minimized. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually add another blade to Remix so we've got blade 103, we did the original demo on, there was another blade enabled, and now we're gonna click other. And all we have to do for the other is go in and modify this address to talk to the blade, which is 101. Simply hit connect, and there we have it. We have our codec, fill, RCSB, A, B, and the stack. You'll see that the channel on off works. You've got level control. Remix is a great little application to pull up any sources in the Wheatstone network, get them on the utility mixer, and hand off remote control to an external uh, PC or an external location. So long as you've got a Windows enabled PC, if you're on a VPN, you can connect directly into the system. If not, you can load this remix on a PC at the station that's connected to the system and simply allow remote access. If you have any questions or you need more info, get in touch with the folks at Wheatstone.